It is decreed the holy and pure are filled with secret wisdom. Rezai Chakma. Chakma. The knowledge is the result of understanding. The wise are humble and cry in joy from the names learned in clear language. The chosen are pure of heart. Make to heal the body. Give grace that measures the strength of the light of the shining star. Gird with the strength. The power is established forever by the actions before the generations. Rejoice in silence from generation to generation of the holy heights. Kedel Shov Merom. It is written as pure gold, a bubbling fountain of purity is established in the center of the sublime power. Of the works of glory, the most precious pearls are not compared with the glory nor the finest gold of Aphair, a city or province famous for the highest quality of gold. The value of wisdom cannot be measured nor understanding of knowledge. Although there is no measure to the value of the secrets written herein as revealed by Elohim, as the force of fire all search therein, as the ruler of the heavens all search therein, the tree of life is supported and guarded and protected as the apple of the eye. By reverence of the Lord the glory is obtained. Obtained the glory to obtain life. Of understanding receive wisdom. Of salvation keep from death. Of fulfillment of, fu of, fulfillment of the nefesh by consecration of the power be strengthened by reverence of the Lord of learning the knowledge understand and fill the heart with wisdom from the drawing of life increase from the soul to the heel form divisions in the garden of Eden Elohim treasures the reverence the Lord fills all the earth with glory as in heaven where the throne is established there is no measure to the glory seven fountains rise and fall to honor of thousand thousands ministers Mesherethim and a myriad myriads hosts Tizebavoth ten million a myriad equals ten thousand the force of fire ignites the fi the river of fire flowing forth the sound shakes the nations in fear of destruction a vision comes forth of the image of a fiery archer as the Tharshish and Sardonyx, and the arrows as swift as lightning, Tarshish and Sardonyx, and arrows as swift as lightning. Tarshish is a semi-precious stone from the Spanish kingdom of the same name. Some suggest it is either amber or chrysolite. It is also the name of the ruling angel of the angelic order of Tarshishayam. The throne of glory resembles ice crystal, surrounded by malachim. The archer Ophan kindles the flames. In Gustav Davidson, Dictionary of Angels, it is noted that Ophan is identified by the ancient sages as the angel Sandalphon and the twin brother of Metatron. The people of the dominion tremble in fear and cover their eyes. The Lord made clouds and fog all around, wrapped in swaddling cloth, dwelling alone upon the throne, concealed and hidden. The worthy go forth to the hidden light. The most profound secrets are revealed. The revelations are made clear, not obscured by darkness. There is nothing in all the universe that compares. All actions and desires are fulfilled by works revealed. Become proficient and the results occur quickly. Those who attempt to duplicate the works receive no results. The souls nefeshoth of the disobedient and rebellious are punished by condemnation, by desire to establish the curse. The sea dries up, the sun and the moon darken, the light of the stars becomes faint, the mountains shift and fall and the earth trembles. This is the result of arrogance. Those chosen are strengthened by the power of the wisdom established by the understanding of the knowledge. In the holy book are 72 signs given by Michael, the great prince above seven princes, ministering before the king, king of kings, Melech, Melechai, Melechim. From it, Adam, the first man, received the 
beginning wisdom. From it awaken and proclaim the names of every living creature, the and bird and creeping thing and fish. From understanding increase the wisdom of all created by Elohim on the sixth day of Genesis. Barashith. Adam read the holy book and learned the letters and words. He knew the words were true. The knowledge lifted him above all other creatures. He was in awe from all he saw therein, and understood that all that is written in the book is the truth. Psalms 119.160 The beginning of your word is truth. It is true. All of the words in the book are the most holy. Great is the glory of every power. In holiness and purity perform the operations. In humility and modesty succeed in all works. Become wise by the spirit of wisdom. Ruach hachma. Hoachma. It is written, Adam prepared a bar of gold and purified it twice by fire. Then he engraved thereupon the signs of the holy book in holiness and purity. Then he placed the book in a cleft of the rock of the east side of the Garden of Eden, not to fall to earth, but to endure and to sustain the power. In every place Adam was sustained. It is proclaimed, Adam wandered upon the earth as a ship upon the sea. He remembered and recorded when mountains melted like wax, and the sea went forth as hoarfrost, and the fire went forth as dust, and lions and leopards and bears and the animals of the pasture stood silent and still, and insects rose up in the air as birds, and the sea became a desert wilderness. 6. These are omens and portents no, probably noted to help predict weather. He remembered and recorded the letters of the holy name before the sun and the moon in Orion, Hakasil. By the light of all luminaries, rule in righteousness and in reverence of Elohim, and hold dominion over the spirit, Ruach, and over violence, Shad, and over misfortune, Feega, ah or enemy, and adversaries, shaitan. Rising o up over men and women, it is written, Be summoned as you wish and desire. He recorded when the stone wall of the tower finally... <clears throat> he recorded when the stone wall of the tower finally fell to the ground, and the fruit trees bear fruit before the proper time, and people take flight before the battles of war. Everything was revealed to him of the Holy Spirit, Ruach HaKadesh, of death and life and of goodness and evil, also the mysterious, uh, the mysteries of hours and minutes of time and numbers of days. Calculate the seasons and anniversaries. Yobelim refers to the equinoxes and solstices until the end of the universe. Measure the time from the beginning until the end. Until the end. Then serve his son Seth, Seth was Adam's third son after Cain and Abel. See Genesis 5, 3. Then serve his son Seth, 7. For, se for ten years instructed according to the way of the holy book, he received understanding of all letters and words engraved in the holy book of all powers revealed. He knew by the powers therein to perform miracles and learn to perform the works. He held the book hidden away in, a, in the cleft of a rock. From the book, Adam learned that the time of death drew near. Every day he rejoiced in adjuration, not eating fruits or vegetables or any meat giving forth blood. Every day he bathed in the purity of running water, once in the morning and once in the evening. He spoke to his son Seth by adjuration alone, not guided by the Holy Spirit. Preparation is difficult. Work only in humility and reverence, in purity and holiness. Every path is revealed, and you become wise by the signs. After all this, Adam was released to the long home. Beth I Iolam, a reference to the cemetery or grave. His son Seth served the Lord. He, he was sustained therein by every power, not turning to the left or to the right from every word spoken by his father Adam. He became wise from understanding the knowledge and received the wisdom of the holy book. He opened the gate of wisdom and understanding, knew the difference between good and evil, be repelled by evil, and choose goodness. 
know the difference between good and evil, be repelled by evil, and choose goodness. See and behold the generations of ancestors coming after, the foolish and the vain and the sinful profane by proclaiming false idols in the name of God, and the disobedient and rebellious tolerate suffering, not knowing or understanding, journey in darkness. Seth became wise by the secrets of the book and the letters of the holy name engraved therein. He learned that God would cause the sea to overflow and destroy all the world by his power. He kept the book in a vault of gold and also placed in the vault all of the precious spices and kept it hidden in a cave. He lived in the city of Enoch built by his brother Cain. See Genesis 4.17.